गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन वेलकम टू अनदर एपिसोड ऑफ टू द पॉइंट टूडेज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज नाइन्थ चाइना अफ्रीका समिट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट सी वाइज इट इन द न्यूज चाइनीज प्रेजिडेंट शी जिनपिंग रिसेंटली होस्टेड मोर देन टू डजन अफ्रीकन लीडर्स इन बीजिंग फॉर द नाइन्थ चाइना अफ्रीका समिट The China Africa Summit, officially called the Forum on China Africa Cooperation. Now let's discuss about Forum on China Africa Cooperation that is FOCAC. The FOCAC was established in 2000 at the request of African nations seeking greater coordination with China. It is held every 3 years alternating between Beijing and an African country as host. The summit has evolved into a key framework for dialogue and collaboration between China and Africa. The meetings and eventual deals usually revolve around the themes of industrialization, agricultural advancements, security, and cooperation regarding China's Belt and Road Initiative. Financial commitments, a hallmark of FOCAC conferences, often capture the most attention, such as the 60 billion US dollars in new financing announced in 2018 and the 40 billion US dollars pledge in 2021. According to China's foreign ministry, the official summit theme is joining hands to advance modernization and build a high level China Africa community with a shared future Now let's understand that why is Africa important for China Africa holds approximately 30% of global mineral resources many of which are critical minerals essential components for the green energy transition defense systems and other high tech applications Minerals accounts for an average of 70% of total African exports and about 28% of the continent's GDP. Nearly 90% of Chinese imports from Africa consist of mineral fuels, ores, stones, metals and other minerals. Thus the mining of critical minerals presents a unique opportunity for economic growth and industrialization on the continent as well as a strategic interest for china which is heavily invested in securing these resources for its industries now moving on to african priorities at fsoc 2024 on the economic front progress on beijing's ambitious goal to import 300 billion dollars worth of goods from african countries between 2022 to 24 has been modest China has similar experience of small scale farming could step in to develop crops fertilizers and pesticides that are suited to african conditions green energy and industrial development are also important for african nations african countries are encouraging their international partners to establish more refining and processing hubs now lastly moving on to conclusion The summit comes at a time when China is increasingly countering United States and European influence in Africa and other developing regions in its climb to global superpower status. Although the US, Japan, India and Russia also hold regular summits to woo the continent's leaders, China is unmatched as the continent's economic partner. Now is the time for practice question. Consider the following statements about FOCAC 2024. When the Forum on China Africa Cooperation that is FOCAC was established in 1990. Two China recently hosted more than 2 dozen African leaders in Beijing for the 9th FOCAC. Which of the statements given above is or are correct? One only two only both one and two or neither one nor two. Send the answer of this question in the comment section. Stay tuned for more such updates. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.